Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Margaret and welcome to Purple Frog. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a room tour of my college dorm. I've been working on this for a little while now. It's not completely done. I still have some posters to hang and whatnot, but for the most part, the bare bones of it is done. So I thought I'd show you guys, so let's get into it. So starting off, here is the door and immediately next to the door is my cat's cat tree because she lives here too. So it's the same one that was in my previous room tour. I just moved this one here. So we also just have the litter box with like this like little thing over it that we got from Ikea. We have the litter scooper thing right there. And then we also have a litter mat to get any stray litter. On the other side of the door, we have this wall and I put two command hooks here and they just hold my backpack and my other bags. So we have like this Uniqlo like crescent moon bag thing. And then I have this other one that I got from Don Quixote. It's just like a giant messenger. Across from my cat tree, I have this set of drawers. Just holds like this first drawer has a lot of cat stuff. The second drawer has a cat hammock for my window, Clorox wipes and a waterproof backpack. And the third drawer just has some extra litter trays for my cat's litter box. On top of it though, we have my headset, a water bottle that I put in my backpack with me, my set, uh, my pencil bag. Yeah, it has like this cute like, little bear charm on it. Look, look how cute that is, that's adorable. I turned it off for this video, but I also have my air purifier because when I have a cat and two, you just need one if you're living in a dorm because you don't know what is in the air, it's just nasty. And then I just have this like little box thingy. I think I got this from like Muji, I wanna say. And it just holds like all of my notebooks for all my classes and whatnot. So yeah, I'm gonna look, look at this one. <laughs> His name is Sheldon. I named him Sheldon. Yeah. So on the side of that, I have my cat's food and water. These are both electric, as you guys can tell, so it's a water fountain and this is timed. She has a lot of food in it right now. But yeah, this is timed. It feeds her every day and every night. So that's really nice. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to worry about filling up the top of it. So that's nice. Here is my bed, which is a standard twin. It is quite shorter than the platform here, which is interesting to say the least. Um, my platform is, is on the riser, so it is a little bit taller. And yeah, it, it, I have to climb up the side because it's so high up. It's really high up. But yeah, I just have this comforter is from Muji. This throw blanket is from Target. And I think those other two pillows are from Target. And then the cases are from Muji, I believe. Below the bed, we have my fridge, which just, I don't know, I got a big one because it can store a lot of stuff, which is good. I have my storage drawers as well underneath the bed. So I have like paper towels and this drawer I have my Mercari stuff. This is like cutlery. This is like other supplies like toolkits and Ziploc bags. A poster that I really need to hang up. I've just been, I, I don't know. I, I need to get some museum putty or whatever you want to call it so I can hang these up. This drawer just has, these are empty. I keep the packaging for my blind boxes. So that's where some of this is. It's just like boxes for the stuff. This is food. And this is like bags, like uh, reusable tote bags and whatnot. This is a little crate that just has some snacks in it that I can reach when I'm in my bed, which is nice. Meds. This drawer is like um, extra desk supplies and like cable protectors and stickers and whatnot that I don't have on my desk. This is more blind bag and other like goods. Um, like I said, I, I like to keep all of it. So I have quite a bit in here. It is like full like all the way back there and like that box and like the boxes have stuff in them too this bottom one here just has miscellaneous anime goods like we have some acrylic stands so we have a uh, dingy power and like pochita here um and there's like chainsaw devil we have oh my god isagi from blue lock like a little mini gyu figure i don't know i just have a whole bunch of random stuff i also have like haiku stickers down there um, another one of the Gyu Kuji prizes, microfiber cloths, a whole bunch of Gyu plushies. Like, I, I say a whole bunch because like I, I really do mean it. I have so many. Look how cute this is though. Like, this is adorable. And then I have some other like unopened goods back here besides just plushies. You guys can see back there. Like, let me grab one. Let me grab this one. Oh my goodness. Here's like a Boa Hancock 
birthday can badge from 2022 like how cute is that adorable i love her so we just put that in there this is just kind of like other anime goods that i don't have on display or that are like unopened this is my nightstand which is just like one of those rolly cart things from ikea i have these like two cups on it or two buckets that are from target on the top shelf here we just have this which is for trash um another thing that just says like batteries and a remote control for like my fan and just like meds I also put my iPad here for when it's charging and whatnot, and we have this this cup, which just has a whole bunch of like ketchup on in it. Like how adorable, and like look at this one, it's like a little ramen bowl, and like if you peel the lid back, it actually is like, are you kidding me? That is adorable! Oh my god, I just, I don't know, I, I keep it near my bed because they make me so happy to look at, so you know, I just keep them there. On the windowsill behind my bed here, we have my cat, ha ha ha. But we have my like little lamp with a bucket, which is where I put like, uh, currently has like nail clipper stuff. It's really cute, it's like Pochaco. Um, But we also have a, what do you call it? Phone charger, water bottle, and Kleenex. I have another fan on the windowsill because it is so stinking hot. There's no AC currently in my unit. So <sighs> a lot of fans. Now moving on to my desk. Oh yes, I forgot to mention, my dad has this- my dad built this screen thing for me because my windows, they open in order to like- and I keep them open for like the fresh air and stuff to help it keep it cool in here and it doesn't have screens, so my dad built this to prevent my cat from escaping. Yeah. But, uh, on the windowsill, I have this bin here which just has a whole bunch of like sticky notes and like card binder supplies and stuff and like flashcards. Um, my current sketchbook that I use and more handouts for my classes underneath it. We have this desk chair, which I think is from Ikea, I want to say, that I got. Um, I'm using this one instead of the other desk chair because I like this one better. I have, like, an air cooler underneath this because, like I said, it's really hot, so bada bing bada boom. I have a mini air cooler here, and then this is my, uh, I guess year-round fan that I'm going to be keeping year-round. And that is this like, I don't know, it's just like a cute small one and it just is good background noise. On my desk here, I have these which are from the container store, which just store some of my uh, line bag goods, I, I guess. It's just like rubber straps and keychains and buttons and all that good stuff is stored in here. It's not on display. I have these crates from Amazon. They're empty for the most part right now. I do have some artwork that I need to put on the wall. So we have these two BJ Alex ones and this full volume one. I got these from, this is Tan on Etsy. I love their stuff. I will have their shop linked below because I love their stuff, okay? It's just too cute. On the same topic of this is Tan, I have these two uh, like little board things that are from the dollar store, okay? Great deal. And they're so cute and they're so tiny, but this is Tian stuff is on them. Like all of my this is Tian merch, I need to get more. But we have this cherry blossoms after winter keychain. We have my BJ Alex Jiwon Kuromi keychain. We have some uh Dear Door, Painter of the Night, and this um what do you call it? Full volume mini one, another BJ Alex one, and then we have this. This is my newest one, and it's so cute. It is this uh full volume dangler charm. Like, look at this. Snow tiger and coral snake. Oh my god, it's so cute. But next to it, I have this, like, little organizer from Muji, which just stores all of my Copics and some more of my other stationary supplies, like my mild, mild liners, and, like, my uh, click art pens from Zebra, my Sakura gel pens, and just all sorts of good stuff. I also have these, like, little clip plushies, which are so cute, and a, like, little card binder behind it. Let's see Card binder has like pom pom pudding themed like this like little keychain that I got from a strawberry news magazine thing and it just has like some cute photo cards and just like other cute cards in it below the organizer here I just have some cute like little stamps that I got in blind bags so we have your Yuji and Anya a acrylic organizer drawer thing that I once again got from Muji. Um, on the first drawer here, I just have like, I don't know, computer stuff and like box cutters and tape measure and scissors. This one here, I have more random supplies. These are my favorite erasers ever. Okay, they're the Muji plastic erasers, hard type, black, small size. Best erasers, okay guys, my absolute favorite. 
This is just like sticky notes and like sticky tabs and whatnot. I don't know. I love this Hongi Don one. This is like my favorite go-to stationery for like Mercari and stuff. It's so cute. Like look at that. That's adorable. This is some of my washi tape. Then I have a drawer full of some of my stickers. I couldn't bring all of them with me. I mean, I can. It's just I don't have a place to put all of them yet. But I just have some stickers. It's so full, I can barely even close it, but yeah. On top of my desk, I have this Hutch thing that I got from Amazon. And I just have some Tokyo Adventure plushies on it. And like these like little one piece ones that are so cute. Like look at all of them, they're like blushing. The second cubby i guess has some keychains back there this like little uh organizer thing i got from daiso we have like this like little pochaco light that is from miniso we have this like little pop mart skull panda warmth figure and this really cute little mofusan shark mini figure like how cute is that i was so lucky when i got this in the blind bag this first big cubby here has some manga we have yakuza fiance my gently raised beast villains are destined to die and business proposal as well as this like little acrylic cubby which is also from daiso that has some acrylic standees in it i have this like little haiku mini easel thing a bachida acrylic stand and then some haiku plushies i also have this binder here which is my primary card binder i need to get another one since this one's getting full but i guess i'll give you guys a quick little flip through we have like some blue lock oh my goodness a lot of blue lock we have these like full volume photo cards so cute we have this and this is tan stuff it's like sticker um this is at the end of the road this is tan is behind it and then i have some more at the end of the road shut line a lot of shut line uh this is from love jinx just random stuff like a sign of affection this one i got with the volume of manga some leaflets spy family tokyo avengers hikaru no go and chainsaw man slam dunk and this is blue lock this came with like a, a volume of the manga the like extra bonus goods so we have the stickers and we have like the clear cards of Bachida because he's my favorite um blue lock character aside from ego IQ, and some is this is Stalin's thing but we have this is from Jujutsu Kaisen whole bunch of Jujutsu Kaisen stuff so like cards yeah more Jujutsu Kaisen uh Kimetsu no Yaiba this is Dr. Stone some Naruto stuff, and then my friend painted these two for me. And then we just, oh, there we go. My friend painted these two and we have some Dragon Ball. At the front, I have this uh, in the Clear Moonlight Dusk card that I got from K-Books. It's really cute. Moving on to the second or like last big cubby here. We just have some random BL stuff and GL stuff. So we have this Love Jinx volume with the two Shikishi boards that I have. This Shot Line Lump Spark pin that came with the box set. Uh, we have the Other Worlds books depend on the bean counter volume one uh the guy she was interested in wasn't a guy all volume one payback volumes one and two um at the end of the road volumes one and two i need to get three and four so badly i need to order them they're just expensive so yeah shut line volumes one to three and then i have on our off volumes one to three and then i have this like little cute like this is from a cafe thing that payback had so cute i just ordered the payback um casino acrylic standees with like the photo cards and stuff i'm really excited my cat is excited too on top of the hutch i have two of these like acrylic risers which just have some of my youth stuff like i said i couldn't i did not bring it all with me i still have some stuff at home and still have some stuff in the drawers and like i have a lot of cute stuff here like this is all canned badges of him and these are all like rubber strap not those but these are all rubber straps of him so, I mean, I still have a lot that I have not put on display, but I just have some of my favorites on display here. I have another one of those organizers that has some canned badges in it. A whole bunch of these, like, sleeping minifigures that are all from, like, Tokyo Adventures. And, like, a Sabito one. And then this, like, Tsukasa Kuji acrylic stand from Dr. Stone. Here is my bookcase, which is one of those collapsible folding ones from Amazon. I still have a lot of space on it, so I'm still bringing some manga from home. So this is nowhere near done yet, but, you know, it's a work in progress. On the top shelf here, since it is too small to have manga facing up like vertically, I decided to put some minifigures for now. So we have Pochita, Aki, Denji, Power, Makima, and like the Chainsaw Devil 
from uh, Chainsaw Man. We have some Hunter x Hunter stuff, Tokyo Avengers, and then some like, look how cute he is. This is like, Chief is like a gangster, it's adorable. And then some just like Haikyuu stuff, so yeah. The second shelf here is basically a shrine to Blue Lock because I love Blue Lock and I've been going through like a Blue Lock renaissance recently. So we have like all of my Bachita stuff. I need to get more, I know. I have more on the way. But like here's some of my favorite stuff. Like I love this King Patch of him. And then we have like these two which I love. And like look at this like little acrylic of him as a bunny. Are you kidding me? That is so cute. I just love him so much. I also have his look up figure and his like little sleeping figure. I have also the sleeping figure for Odin and Isagi. I still need to get the sleeping figures for Nagi and Chigiri. But yeah, I have more acrylic stands of him, of Bachira, this ego acrylic, the Nagi Nandroid. I need to get the Isagi one and they need to make a Bachira one. Like, please make a Bachira one good smile. The Bachira plushie, these like little like washing your back minifigures. So I have Chigiri, Bachira, and Odin. Another ego acrylic. The Blue Lock manga, I have only made ordered. Okay, guys, it is coming. Some more mini acrylics from Blue Lock. And then we have like this like, little nuggy one and this one of Baro. So cute. Moving on to the next shelf. I just realized how out of order the manga is. Oh my goodness. But I have Mob Psycho 100. I have Volumes 1 to 9 and the spin off. And then I also have the Mob Psycho 100 Kogiyama Nendo with Dimple. I love him so much. He's like the number one character I can. So. Of course, I have to have him. I have the Cheeky Brat manga here with this Dr. Stone mini acrylic. And then I have a whole bunch of Spy Family stuff on top of it. Like a little acrylic riser. Like how cute is all of this? This is so adorable. How cute to see the little balloons. Are you kidding me? It's adorable. But yeah. Then I have Akane Banashi volume 1. Toki Oilins volumes 1 to 4. And then the Apothecary Diaries 1 to 9. And Windbreaker volume 1. With these cute little parfait Jujutsu Kaisen, Itadori Yuji, and Megumi. Like little acrylics, acrylic stands. Acrylic keychains. I love them so much. They're so cute. Adorable. The next shelf here is a work in progress. I have Crossplay Love, some volumes of Japanese manga here. Ooh, there we go. And we have some of my gals manga. I'm working on getting the rest of it. Okay, guys. I have all of the spin off that's out. And then I am working on getting the original series. So, yeah. I have this like little acrylic keychain of Ran and her crew. We also have a little acrylic of Mia and this like little acrylic of Ran. Ah, I love her. I have cat hair everywhere. But yeah, I have more gals keychains and merchandise coming. So I'm really excited about that. The last shelf that has manga on it um, is also pretty empty because I don't know, I'm trying to also keep it empty enough. So I have plenty of room to grow my collection of manga and whatnot here. So yeah. I have Kaiju number 8, volumes 1 to 7, so that's all that is out so far, I believe. And I also have In the Clear Moonlit Dusk, volumes 1 to 5, which I think is all that is out. Don't quote me on that, though. I think that's all that's out. I don't think volume 6 is out yet, so. But the last shelf on my bookcase here just holds some of my school stuff. So we have a, uh, like, little, what do you call this? A folder that just holds some school stuff, my computers, my Mac, and then we have this Chromebook. And then I just have my Chinese textbooks and then my... Chinese history art history textbook yeah I want to get some wall art to put up there I'm thinking about putting the other wall art that I have so far up over here somewhere but I really want to get some more wall art because it clearly needs it that is the door to my bathroom I will not be showing that because I don't know I feel like it's kind of just I don't know it just has like my own I just have like my own shower toilet my closet is in there as well and my sink and whatnot so that's just what's in there but I have a mirror on the back of the door because yeah we have like my like little calendar thing and i have this like little strip that just has like my syllabuses of things for class with like due dates and like i don't know this is like magnetic and it has like my pens and stuff so i can like write stuff off and cross cross stuff off and i guess the last thing for this tour is my shoes so yeah i just have converse dunks um on clouds and my slides i hope this helps some people that are moving into their dorms right now but that is my, I guess, anime themed college dorm tour. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and so does Una. And yeah, don't forget to comment, rate, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Oh my gosh, she's attacking me.